John, I think we all need a, a long lie down after the drama of tonight's event. You must be really pleased to have gone through, though. I'm delighted with the win. Um, possibly uh, the way we got there. Uh, a little bit topsy-turvy. Give Carlisle, as you were thought, to be magnificent for the first 20 minutes of the second half. Uh, pinned us back. Got on the front foot, passed the ball well, showed a great energy. Everything I like my teams to do. And I thought we'd done that to them in stages in the first half. So given the Juno going down to, to ten men and and a goal down, they really took the game to us and thoroughly deserved to go 2 1 You had to play a lot of your own game on Saturday with, with ten men. Did you get a little bit of a taste of your own medicine in, in that first part of the second half? Well, unfortunately for us and fortunately for them, their, their two chances they had with ten men they, they gobbled up. Whereas we didn't on Saturday. Um, you know, Baz made a good save in the first half, and the two chances they've had have probably been their, their only attempts on goal, but they scored two from three. But that doesn't tell the story because they pinned us back very well and they bossed the game for 20 minutes, which was disappointing considering we had a man more than us. Take you right back to the beginning of the game. It was a pretty even start to proceedings, but when Craig Linfield got in and fired that in the bottom corner, it was a class finish, wasn't it? It was a great finish, and I thought we were, we were the best team first half. I thought we played with a good energy. Uh, Louis, um, Moulton, Craig Linfield in particular caught the eye. Uh, very impressive, wanting to work hard on the channels. And I thought uh, we thoroughly deserved to go in leading. Uh, they were a bit unfortunate with the sending off. I think both players have gone for the ball. It was just the one who got there first. It was probably going to be uh, the least guilty. And as it worked out, the lads already been booted. Um, but you know, given the due that you know they they still battled on with the time. Were you frustrated at the two goals you conceded, both from corners? Well, the second one, you know, man not being picked up, and the first one, uh, a little bit of head tennis, and you know we've got an extra man in them, so they shouldn't have a man spare on the edge of the box to, to slam it in. I said I'm getting them the wrong way round, don't I? So. Yeah. And then, as frantic finishes go, you threw the kitchen sink at their keeper, he made a couple of superb saves, but eventually you got that breakthrough and, and levelled it. Made a great save off Joshi and a great save off Craig Linfield. Um, you know, it was a good move for the, the one that led to the second sending off. I think we'd have, we'd have probably got a shot on from the edge of the box. I wouldn't say it was a goal scoring opportunity, but you know, second yellow probably uh, justified. But then, you know, it was always going to be difficult for them because they played so long with ten to then go down to nine and the space was always going to be around the sides of them. And once we twigged to that and exploited it, we were always going to make chances. It was just a case of whether you run out of time or not.